Hey folks, come on in and check out this beautiful rifle. This is the Checkpoint Phenolic. This is their uh, VZ58 series of rifles. Now, it looks like an AK, but it's not an AK. So I'm gonna try to just give you a kind of a, a brief history on these guns. This gun uh, was designed with AK-like intentions, but AK parts do not interchange with the gun. It is chambered in the 762 by 39 caliber, and it does have some AK inspiration, but uh, not gonna take an AK mag, not gonna take an AK stock set. But here's some cool things, and this is kind of more for you as an advanced um, military rifle collector, or if you have an advanced uh, Kalashnikov pattern series of rifles like we do here at Atlantic Firearms, you wanna to start to look at some of the other variants that are out on the market that were made by some of the other um, com block countries. So this one is definitely unique. It has a milled receiver instead of a stamp receiver. However, this milled receiver is definitely a lot lighter than your standard um, you know, Russian pattern or Polish pattern rifles. Definitely has a different setup with the uh, bolt and the bolt carrier and the fact that the entire dust cover is open uh, there on the top and it slides back. The rifle itself, even though it does have a milled receiver, is lighter in weight. So most of your AKs are gonna be in that seven to seven and a half pound range. And maybe the milled guns might be pushing closer to eight. This gun weighs in approximately in the six and a half pound range. So it definitely feels a little bit lighter, but the milled receiver definitely is supposed to increase the accuracy and potentially the longevity of the gun. Um, these have extremely nice uh, barrels in them. This one is uh, threaded 14 by one on left-hand thread. It does uh, sport the beaver bark furniture that you see here. Now this is a definite distinctive uh, furniture set to this specific gun. And again, it's uh, affectionately called the beaver bar uh, furniture, but it's similar, uh, I guess, in the look of some of the older Bakelite style stock sets you would see. This is, I guess, a, a wood impregnated furniture. Or in, uh, in fact, that it's uh, basically wood chips that I guess are glued together. I don't know all the exact details, but it's definitely unique to this gun. And of course, the people at Checkpoint finish this gun off in a nice uh, gray finish. This is one of the more popular models that they offer. These guns are made in the Czech Republic, and then they're imported into the United States and put into a 922R compliant format uh, for U.S. shooters to enjoy by Checkpoint USA. They offer some very unique guns uh, that are out there, so we're going to put this one down. We do have a lot of different Checkpoint models, and we are fortunate that uh, we do have a great relationship with the fine folks over at Checkpoint USA, and we're able to get some of these guns in. They do not come in large waves or volumes. So this is not something that we're gonna see a thousand or 1500 models come in each month. They basically come in in smaller models. It is kind of a unique and a collector series gun, but this is their tactical model, has the collapsing stock. It does have the uh, muzzle brake on the front end, the black style finish, again, chambered in 7.62 by 39. Now, the gun that you saw there does not have a scope rail. This gun does have the scope rail on the left-hand side. That is an additional item that can be added to the gun and the fine folks again at Checkpoint did add it to this model. Now this is probably the second most popular uh, VZ rifle that we offer from uh, Checkpoint. Again, the Phenolic being the number one. This does uh, sport a black stock set. It's attractive. I really like the um, more traditional style, but for a tactical, this uh, suits the needs. And it does have this nice clear mag and kind of an ergo grip. Good looking gun again. Um, really have not had any customers that I'm aware of that have complained about these uh, rifles or pistols that they offer. Now, here's another short and sassy uh, little character here. This is the VZ58 Sporter pistol. Um, again, uh, made in the Czech Republic. You know, great uh, gun. It is chambered in the 762 by 39 I believe that uh, they do offer several different model lengths in this. This is just one of the ones that we we're fortunate enough to get in. Definitely compact, as you can see. And there are uh, certain brace and stock options that can be added to these down the road if you wanted to get into something like that. But definitely a cool, uh, neat little piece. Again, uh, probably more of a collector's piece or for the advanced uh, AK uh, Kalashnikov patterned uh, style gun. Uh, there are other AK pistols that are out on the market, might be less expensive, but probably not as unique as this pistol. So just something to check out. Last but not least, uh, we have the um, Scorpion pistol. Uh, that you see here, and it comes with a couple of mags in the nice case. Again, the Scorpion pistols, 
uh, have been out on the market for quite some period of time. Again, real cool pistol, been very popular. Unfortunately, we aren't able to get many of the Checkpoint products, especially these Scorpion pistol pistols, so they tend to come and go out of stock pretty quickly. Now, this is just a sampling of some of the products that we get in from Checkpoint. So if you would like to check these out, of course, you can um, like that, check these out. You can stop by our website and uh, you also definitely want to let us know what you're looking for so we can continue to communicate uh, with the Checkpoint crew and say, hey, we have a lot of people that are interested in this model or others. Please bring them in so we can get them out into hungry shooters' hands.